Hello everybody, my name is AFH Gaming and welcome to a new RPG indie adventure horror game Let's Play. This is called Misao. Now I've recently uh, searched for an RPG indie horror game and I found this one. That This seems to be um, for Mac. So this Mac version, unfortunately, it does not have a full screen version, I am very sorry. It's for Mac users, of course, developer, the developer just decided not to put Mac's full screen, which is really stupid, only for Windows. I highly apologize, and I'm sure, I hope you understand. But without further ado, let's just enjoy this game. Enter this girl's name with a keyboard. Okay. Aki. Now, I'm gonna change it, actually. Let's call her, uh, Natasha. There you go. Welcome to your new game. Is Natasha alright? Of course. Help. Find me. <clears throat> okay. Uh, Misao? Is that you, Misao? Misao! Whoa, nice room. W was I dreaming? I'm, I'm actually doing, gonna do a voiceover for all the characters in here. I thought I heard Misao. I guess it was just a dream. It's been three months. Oh no! It's late! I'm going to be late for school! Misao never stood out too much in our class. She was just a simple girl, really. I wasn't too close to her, but I was always worrying about Misao being alone. I hoped I could be her friend, but that didn't happen. Three months ago, Misao went missing. She wasn't coming to school, and she hadn't come home either. She's not the type of she's not the type to flee home. Our parents were saying that she might have got gotten involved in something. Well, I'm off. Our class spread the rumor that Misao was long dead by now. I really hope they're wrong. I wanted to be her friend. Interesting. Did she like vanish or something? Find me. Help me find me, okay. Ooh, first day of school! <clears throat> so, here and then you have the attractive teacher of Natasha's class, popular with students for his ge generosity. Mr. Soda, as cool as ever. <laughs> Ayaka. Strange name. That voice I heard in my dream, was that me, Sal? And Mr. Soda noticed her. You've got guts to ignore my lecture. Eek! <laughs> this information will be essential for the test, so you'd better listen. Soda. <laughs> Very strange names, indeed. E yes, sir. I'm, I'm sorry. <laughs> Giggle. Was that the end of class? Wow. Ooh. Mr. Soda has a new suit, like, wow, super suave. <laughs> Natasha's best friend, a fat following girl who looks up to Mr. Soda. Ayaka, you've been talking him up all morning. Don't you ever get tired of babbling, blab blabbing? But he's such a ladies' man. He's so nice and smart and the best. <laughs> That's actually a pretty good voice for her. Oh yeah, gotta use some hand cream. Do do do. Did you hear? I did. There's a rumor Mr. Soda has a hand fetish. So maybe if I clean my hands constantly, every day, all the time, he'll like me more. You're too. You're barely his age. Whoa. I don't really care, Ayaka. Don't really care, she says. Ha! You've got no eye for men, Natasha. Seriously, what do you see in a seducer like Toma? What the hell, man? I... I never said I liked anybody. I just think he's kind of cool, that's all. Really? Nay? <laughs> yes, really. Who the hell is Toma? 
Yushino. There's been some spooky paranormal business going on at this school. I'm getting a little freaked. Whoa. That must be Toma! <laughs> paranormal, my ass. <laughs> Natasha's classmate, a boy, carefree in appearance, personality, everything. I'm for real. It's for real. The other day, a, a kid in the other class got dragged away in the bathroom. Natasha's classmate, leader of the bullies. How interesting. There was, all, there was also the glass in the third floor hallway being broken from inside. Um, that's a good voice for him, actually. Kudu, Natasha's classmate, a calm, early maturing youth. Gotta be ghosts. Eek! I'm scared! Said Tomi. Natasha's classmate, just a Tomi, for sure. Toma's girlfriend. Wow! Ghosts, huh? Dumbass! Those ain't exist. Wow. Wait, what if this is Misao's curse? What? <laughs> Look, this is no time for jokes! But I mean, it's totally possible. It's been three months since she's vanished, then it's this stuff just suddenly stops. If those events are Misao's curse, then Yushino, I'll be cursed sooner or later. Or later. Hmm, whatever did I do? Yushino, you did bully Misao a lot. Bullying? I, why, I never. I was just making a little fun. Disappointing, really. And Toma always screw with me, Sao. You're the you're the one who'll get cursed. Me? Ha! Huh, I'm fine. Me, Sao looked up to me. I wonder. Toma, I'm scared. I mean, I'm your girlfriend. Me, Sao might have a grudge. Don't sweat it, Tommy. I'll protect you. Oh, you're so nice, Toma. <laughs> Bah, do what you like, lovebirds. Misao, please don't curse us. The rest are a fair game, though. Oops, did I say that out loud? <laughs> oh no, an earthquake! An earthquake? What? It got dark right quick. What the heck's going on? Maybe, just maybe, it really is Misao's curse. Misao's real mad at us. Shut up. What the hell? I was just kidding about the curse crap. Wow. Uh, Natasha? Help. Misao? Misao! I can hear her speaking to me! Oh, now it's gonna be her. Sh shut up! I don't hear her damn voice! Natasha! You're talking crazy talk! I'm not, uh... Find me! M me, Sal? Help me find me! Help me find me! Wow! Did everyone just die? Nah. Me so. Uh, you finally come to. Where am I? I was just in the classroom. And who are you? I am Unigawara. The student council president, and this is the student council room. Luckily for you, you've ended up somewhere safe. Ended up? After the earthquake, the school was sucked into another world. This sent those inside flying all across the school. Another world? What's that supposed to mean? And why would that happen? Well, it's a curse. <clears throat> it is the result of a girl's curse that this school was sealed in the other world. A curse? It couldn't be Misao? President Onigawara! Whoa! Wh who the hell is that? Pan, Pan, finally made it! I, I thought I was a goner. 
So, you finally return, Miss Library. Miss Library! There are no such names as Miss Library. She's the school's vice president, always in the library, so that's what we call her. So then, Miss Library, how does it look? It's, it's messed up, up and gunked up and funked up. The foundation and everything is wrecked, and I haven't been able to find any exits. Plus, evil spirits are going to attack people. I saw a student killed before my eyes. I'll never be able to eat hamburgers again. Oh, it was frightening. So I see. Thank you for your report. You may retire for now. What? Retire? Yes, well, I'm going to go back to the library. Call me anything. Call me anytime you need me. Wow. Evil spirits. The curse must have summoned them. The school is now a den of spirits, and there's nowhere to run. Uh, um... There's only one solution, undoing the girl's curse. There's surely no other way. How am I supposed to undo a curse? By saving the girl's soul, Miss Natasha. You must know what it is you have to do. I do? Find me. How am I supposed to find her? Misa was calling me, so she wants to be found? Mr. Onigawara, I'll go look for Misa. So you will. As library informs me, the school is full of evil spirits, and yet you wish to go. I will, because Misa is my friend. Understood. You are entrusted with the fate of the school. I believe you can do it. If you encounter any trouble, pay a visit to the library on the second floor. She will try her best to help. If you wish to make a record, please talk to me. I will do so for you any time. Will you save? Of course I will! What do you think, game? Just save the freaking. Okay, there you go. You can also press C or Shift to make a quick save deleted when the game is closed. You can ask a library for more details. Right, so C to save quickly. I pray for your safety. Oh, that sound though. Okay, the adventures begin! Ugh. Oh, dramatic songs, wow. Let's see where I can go. A flower pot, nothing of order. Right? Blood prints, wow. So, this is basically the office. Principal's diary. The emergency exit key fell out of the vase. Somebody pick it up. The, what? what? The emergency exit key fell out of the vase. So, so, so there's, a, there's a vase and there's a key. Nothing out of the ordinary. A vase. It's fixed to the table. Inspect it. Okay. Ow! Got prickled by a rose thorn. Oh! The rose was poisoned. It courses through Natasha's body. What?! I'll destroy it. Destroy. Ah! I need to go find a bat, maybe. Okay, no, I know. I get what to do. Right. Let's explore the school. Locked. What's in here? Ayaka! Locked. Locked. I assume everything's locked. Yep, everything's locked. Nothing of the order. Let's talk to Ayaka. Ayaka, thank goodness you're safe. Natasha, you're just in time. Now's a chance of a lifetime. Since nobody's around, we're free to look in Mr. Soda's desk. Oh, come on. This is no time for that. Look at what's happening to the school. Look, top drawer packed with love letters to Mr. Soda. Who dares? Who is it who dared to send love letters to my Mr. Soda? Let's find out what they wrote. Ayaka, that really doesn't matter right now, so let's get somewhere safe. No way! I can see everything, and I haven't even looked in the bottom drawer. You can pass up the opportunity, but I won't. Fine. Why do I care? Soda's desk. Well, can I look at it? Oh, great, then. Alright, I'm out. Bye, Erica! Weirdo. The vending machine. Buy some juice. Hmm. It seems I need coins. Okay, I got it. What can I do in the meantime? 
What is that? Adorn these places. B D. That doesn't make any sense though. Man, there's so many places. Whoa! Got bat. Oh, we're back. Wait, I can break the face. Let's go back. Break the face. Destroy. You can't break with your bare hands. Of course, I can't break with my bare hands. How do you go to your game saved? Okay. How'd you like going to your inventory? What? How do I go into my inventory? I don't want to save the freaking game. Oh, for God's sake. Is there like an inventory that you can go to? Guys, I'll be just right back. Just let me think if I can go to inventor or something. Be right back, guys. Right, okay, guys. It seems that um, there are some other stuff how I can break it. So you can't actually look at your inventory or stuff. But um, I guess I need to keep on looking for more clues. <clears throat> Somebody be going to the boys' bathroom. Look that. Fire extinguisher. What can I do with a fire extinguisher? Oh, it's Toma! And. Uh oh! Tell me! Tell me, help! Oh my god, she's gonna kill me. Uh, uh, ah! Tell me! No! Oh god, I need to save her. I have to save! I have to save her! I need something to drive it away. What can I drive it away with? I'm not gonna approach it. Fire extinguisher! Perfect! Now I can kill that evil spirit. Oh, fantastic! Fantastic, Natasha! So tell me! How dare you do this to Satomi? Take this monster! Whoa! Oh no! Satomi! Oh shit. Dead. Of course dead. What do you think? She's dead! What can I do? Oh, for God's sake. No one in the bathroom. Gross! Okay, that's gross indeed. How about the woman's bathroom? Well, I don't think there's anything in here, though. Hmm. Go in. Let's go in here. What is this? <clears throat> Looks like an infirmary. Bed. Why? Why? Why did I choose to sleep? Don't tell me I'm gonna die now. Oh, I'm gonna die. Yeah, I'm dead. Oh, I'm alive. Oh, wow. out of the ordinary. Oh god! Weird. Yelp! Yoshino. Uh oh. Uh oh! No! Oh my god. Natasha, will you help me? Help. I need to help her. I'd like to help you, but you're always bullying people. Huh? What? What about it? If you promise not to bully weak people anymore, then I'll be willing to help. All right, geez, sure. I won't do it. Now help me here before he comes back. Who? <laughs> oh, no. Hey, he's here. No, chainsaw. No, I don't want to be test subject. I got to hide somewhere. Where can I hide? Ah, where can I? WHERE CAN I HIDE?! BOX! IT'S TOO SMALL! Corpse, like a mansion. HIDE! YES, JUST HIDE! <laughs> I hope I don't get- Am I hiding in the- Please don't know. God. What's that sound? NO! STOP! I think she's dead. Uh, yeah! Goodbye, Ishino! She's definitely dead. Oh my god. Yeah, definitely. Oh my god. Looks like I lost her left. Yuck, I'm covered in blood. Gotta wash myself somewhere. In the girl's bathroom, of course, you can do that. Why the hell didn't you save her instead of freaking asking questions? What is that? The caps contain some. Bunch of switches. Press one. Uh oh! Ah, monster! No! No! Wait. Oh. 
Task Queue. Controls device activated. Sure. A boot disk. Okay. Let's just save here. What can I do? What? Natasha was startled by the telephone, hit the wall, and gave a final breath. What? How can you die from a phone? For God's sake. Wait. I have an idea to do this with a little kid. Come here, little kid. Die! <laughs> it's fainted. Oh well, at least I killed it for fun. Hmm. Game three. Let's see. What? What? Evil spirits! Ah! Cool students 2A. Bruno Goldman. Okay. No, no, not, not really important. So I just watched watched all my classmates die. I have to go wash her now. Whoa. Let's wash up. Wash up! Freaking wash up! Why is she not washing up? Sound, anyways. Oh, Natasha, please just wash up. Okay, this is very strange indeed. I haven't even checked out the floors yet. Make a wash up here somewhere. Just explore the rooms first. can now use the warp function. Awesome! Well guys, I think we're out of time here, but in the next video, hopefully, we will progress and wash all the blood out of Natasha. And yeah, so if you like that if you like me playing this, please leave a like for more and subscribe to join the AFH Army, and I'll see you all, hopefully, in part two. Adios.